Why are you choosing scissors? <laughs> Please. Let's get like fruity bubble tea. Fruity bubble tea? Like fruity juice, yeah. Let's see. Yeah. You got your glasses on, can you? Here it got to use the zoom. What? What the fuck? Real fruit is over here. I don't Let's think it's real fruit. Yeah, real fruit is the place you go. go. Okay, look at the fruit. It would have been primary colors if I got blue, but it's fine. It's okay. It's fine. I'm like so scared. Okay, ready? <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> Do you like it? Do you hate it? How could you dislike this? It tastes like vanilla. Do you like it? Yeah. It's like, oh my god, it tastes so good. Do you like it? Guys, I'm only getting this down. Oh my goodness, this is her new obsession. What about you guys? How is it? It's like unique. You, it's like, I've unique. never ordered this combo before. Mm. Do you like the tapioca with it? I haven't had the tapioca yet. Yeah, she's lucky. She's lucky. Usually you just get it all, all the time. And of course you like hers. Yeah, yeah. She's a mango. But it always depends on the mango ripeness. But it's good too. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. 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 <laughs> this actually tastes so good. Wait, I should have gotten large, bro. <laughs> we got more to eat. <laughs> Stop. The drink itself, maybe like, like, it's something that like, I'd order something else. Maybe like a six. A six? A six? Damn. She's she's picky. We are. We... <laughs> this is like my third choice. Uh, mm -hmm. What would you have gotten? It? Like, wait, have you ever ordered something from here before? Uh, no, actually. Ah. Uh, but but I I think I ordered like the milk teas before, so. And the milk teas don't get them here. They're not that good. How would you rate yours? I would say today it's like a eight out of ten. I've had that. Mine is ten out. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we're getting New York fries. That was the decision. <laughs> that was the decision. Well, it was either, yeah, after A&W. She said A&W, we were like, but we want New York fries, which was her other option, so we're going with that. I'm the cool kid with the hot dog, and like, they're the ones that got like fries or whatever from New York fries. Yeah, I don't like, know who would do that, would, but like, I don't know, they're like different. They're yeah. quirky. Fate, I swear to God. Okay, I want to go to I Halo Crunch. Let's do it. Let's do it. Wherever that is. You already started eating ice cream, so, so I can't sorry. vlog it. Like, I vlog. Oh my God. And then you. That's a single scoop. We're so tired. We're waiting. We've been in Urban for like, like an hour. Because they have so much stuff, man. I know. So okay, we'll show them what you're getting. Well, besides the maroon thing that you have to try on. Okay, so this one I haven't tried on yet, but it's cute, you know? It's like a little maroon little thing. We'll see. There's a Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse crew neck. Mm -hmm. Look at that. You can't hate Mickey Mouse crew neck. And this one. I know y'all can't feel this, but... It's velvet. I wish you could. 
They're, it's like a really soft, velvety, black little hoodie. It's very cute. That's what I'm getting. Guys, I have so much stuff on me. Okay, I'm getting bro. Okay, bro. Bro? Mm -hmm. I'm getting this big Playboy t shirt. <laughs> this bigger crew neck. It is, mm -hmm. Yeah, it is a crew neck. Mm -hmm. It's so big. It's like, a, it's like a dress. I could just wear this as a dress. Yeah. And they're cute. The colors are cute. And they're really soft. So I like them. That's it. That's it. Oh my right. god. Oh. Pose for the mirror. I was waiting for you to turn the camera on to me to do my pose thing. I was like, when is she gonna get to me, man? I need to I got it. That's not my name. Guys, that's not my name. <laughs> that's not my name. Hi guys, please ignore how like messy I look right now. I thought I could show you guys like a small haul basically of what I got yesterday. I kind of forgot to show you guys yesterday, but that's fine. I'll show you now. So I thought this is perfect because I got this from Hot Topic yesterday and to anyone who doesn't know, this is for Stranger Things. Hawkins High School, it's the high school that is in Stranger Things. And I thought it's perfect because I'm going to the fan expo today to see Joseph Quinn. So I think this is like the perfect thing to wear. If you know, you know. <laughs> This is something that I didn't get yesterday. I've had this for like a couple years now. I believe I might have also gotten it from Hot Topic, but I'm not too sure. It's a hoodie for Stranger Things and it's the perfect like everything. It's literally like my favorite hoodie of all time. I would also wear this to the fan expo, but it's just so warm and humid today that I think I'm just gonna stick to the t-shirt. But I am going to the fan expo again this Sunday to see Jamie Campbell Bauer anyway. So I think maybe I'll leave this for Sunday. So we'll see. I'm like so excited, but so nervous at the same time. This is the Hawkins t-shirt, these jeans, and this t-shirt. I'm not trying to go really crazy here. It's just like a casual like photo thing. Like, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. What if I pass out? Sometimes, I wonder if she can see me through your eyes. Oh, what would she think of me now? want to get an autograph we would just go but we're getting a photo it's way better photo is way better we're just really tempted right now There's no way we just met him and it was so quick, it was like two seconds, it's worth it. It's so worth it. <laughs> Thank you. 
what a day. I still refuse to believe that we just casually met Joseph Quinn for like a good two seconds. That was the best two seconds of my life. Yeah, exactly. It was worth it, but it's like I still feel like I didn't actually meet anybody. forgot to talk about being at the fan expo where I met Joseph Quinn for like a good two seconds to take a photo with him which I'm still processing this is the photo which you probably can't even see that really well yeah you can still see a reflection but it's okay point is you can see that like it's me with him okay that's what truly matters i did not know it would be this big but i'm glad it is i just didn't know that but yeah it was such an amazing experience i've never gone to anything where it's like i'm meeting like a celebrity so this is a huge thing for me it was so surreal and it was super crowded everyone was so excited to meet him as they should be and you know we got there just saw him and then you know like we're next and i'm and i'm going and i'm looking at him and he's like hello i don't even remember if i responded anything to him so he must think i'm a little bit like but i was just like starstruck and it was so insane and then like i had to run over so he put his arm around me and like oh my god and then like we just like focus on the camera afterwards because no matter what we could not look bad in this one photo okay this is like a huge moment in our lives but luckily it turned out super well and then after he was like oh how are you doing and again i don't remember we responded i feel like i might have said something like oh like we're doing amazing i don't know and then after like like the other people were next so we had to leave and then he was just like oh bye it was nice seeing you and i was like oh my gosh and i said and i think i said like bye love you but already like the other people were like hi and like he just said like hi to the next people and like oh my gosh it was just crazy and he was so sweet and you know i can't even begin to imagine how tiring it must have been for him i was already tired and like i didn't do anything i just went to the center you know, went to the exhibit, took the photo, come back, and I'm already, like, exhausted. And he has to be there, like, the whole day, like, either signing autographs or taking photos, like, constantly. I don't think he was even meant to be here on Thursday because the fan expo is four days long. I'm pretty sure he, like the other Stranger Things cast, was supposed to just be here on the weekend. So today and tomorrow, but I think he extended it to longer, which is... It's a really sweet thing to do, like honestly, like it's a very exhausting thing, especially if it's not as organized as they did it, thank god. You know, it wasn't very chaotic, but it was an amazing experience, such a nice guy, and again, it's just so surreal, like it happened so quickly that I didn't actually realize it was him that I was taking a picture with. I was just like, oh yeah, I'm just taking a picture with a man, yeah, you know, with a British accent, and then like we go, we get the photo, and I look at it, and I'm like, Oh my god, that's a Joseph Quinn's face. It's so crazy. I'm gonna cherish this photo forever. And I am so excited for tomorrow because I'm also gonna be doing the same thing to see Jamie Campbell Bauer and oh my gosh. That one is gonna be a really big one because I know him not just for Stranger Things, right? He's had roles in lots of other movies that I know and have seen, so... It would be a really huge like starstruck moment for me. Like if I couldn't even speak to Joseph Quinn, I don't know how I'm gonna react tomorrow. Let's hope that photo also turns out well and I'll keep you updated on that. Hi guys, it's like 8.40 a.m. the next day. If you hear any noises, that's just the uh, people working on the roof. Today's the last day of the fan expo, so I'm going to be meeting Jamie Campbell Bauer from the Stranger Things cast, which is so surreal. This is the makeup look. 
for today. So I'm just wearing like a plain t-shirt and shorts, but I'm planning to wear my Stranger Things hoodie for today's photo. But because it's so hot, both outside and inside, I plan to just bring it with me. And then when the actual time comes where we have to line up and take the photo, then let's put it on. We'll see how it goes. I'll get back to you later. Sometimes, I wonder if she can see me through your eyes. What would she think of me now? Just reading Jamie Campbell Bauer. I will never wash my hand or my arm because he touched me and shook my hand. We both have his hands. Exactly. And he also makes eye contact. His eyes are like pure and blue. He's so hot and he smells so. <laughs> Hi guys. Sorry if I look a little bit unkept. I just came back home after seeing Jamie Campbell Bauer today, which is still insane. It's super crazy. And I think today was nicer besides the fact that it was much, much busier. I think it was the busiest because most of the celebrities were here today, not just for Stranger Things, for everyone um, in general. It was nice because when we were actually taking the photo with Jamie, he actually took the time to like shake our hands and everything because he was able to. There was more time for him to do so. Apparently Apparently he was able to do whatever poses we wanted like we didn't want anything crazy so we just like have a picture of us hugging him which I will show you so that's him and we're hugging him and yeah it's just it's just so crazy and then after we left like we freaked out again and you know freaking out about the fact that like we just met him we like know what he smells like you know like all the things you would usually freak out about when you meet someone that like you literally have seen so often on the tv screen and now it's like you just met them in person and i think it's like since i've never done this before that's why i'm only having this revelation now which is that when you meet someone that is like a star are a celebrity from like acting or singing and then you meet them in person you might expect that it's almost as if you're being blessed <laughs> like you're meeting a god or something but in reality they're just like real human beings so like what i'm trying to say is not that i was disappointed in any way after meeting joseph and jamie it was an amazing experience and i'm so glad i got to do it but there was just that sort of realization that when I met them and took the picture with them, I'm just taking a picture with a normal person, but they're very well known and they're famous and everything, so it's much more meaningful. I don't know if you understand what I'm trying to say, but that is what happened. But it's still a huge deal. I think this is going to be the end of this video. I'm trying to aim for my next video to be something about the first week of uni, but I have no idea if that's actually what I'm going to do. But thank Thank you for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed it and if you like leave a like and a comment and please subscribe to my channel and i hope to see you in my next video bye